Now, comic book fans may remember this guy. New stories about footballing icon Roy of the Rovers have been released by an Oxford publisher. Rebellion have revamped the comic book star for a new graphic novel. The updated hero is being used in schools to encourage a love of reading. Jeremy Stern has the story. If you're looking for a footballer to win you a match, Roy Race is your man. He first appeared in Tiger in 1954 before earning his own top billing. Superfan Mark Towers has collected thousands of Roy of the Rovers comics. He's just the, the footballer that everybody want, wants to be. The match winner, the captain, the leader that, uh, that, that, that's there as part of the, the, the storyline. So when he was Melchester Rovers, he, he was captain, he ended up being manager, player manager. So he, he's the one, the, the ideal model footballer in that sense. This new incarnation has been 18 months in the making at Rebellion, a publisher in Oxford. It's trying to have the characters to speak in a way which sort of, you know, people will uh, recognise hopefully today for a 2018 audience. It kind of helps that I've got a 12 year old at home, I guess. You know, I can earwig on him and sort of steal some of the things he says. Most of the best characters you can think of, Bart Simpson, Mickey Mouse, Darth Vader, you can tell who those characters are from their silhouette. And that was really important that when I was creating the whole team, the Melchester team, that each character should be easily um, identifiable by their silhouette alone. The new graphic novel is the first of a series. There's going to be more highs for Roy, there's going to be a lot more lows for Roy. Uh, there's going to be more trials and tribulations for the team in general. Uh, it's just a real roller coaster ride. Uh, good for fans of football, good for fans of drama. There's something in there for everyone. Rebellion's now working with the National Literacy Trust. Books have been given to thousands of children to improve their reading and introduce them to their new hero. Jeremy Stern, BBC South Today.